Hey there, today I am bringing you another Nutrition Grocery Haul video. I did my first Nutrition uh, order a while back ago, maybe a couple weeks ago, a few weeks ago, I don't remember. Um, but I finally placed another order and I got so many great products. These products I am looking forward to using in my next product review video. So definitely keep an eye out for that because I am going to be testing my ketones for these products and really excited. So I will go ahead and show you what I got. I wanted to try these protein chips. They looked pretty good. This one's spicy nacho cheese and I love spicy. So I wanted to try these out. These are four net carbs for one bag, a little on the high side for me, but I really wanted to try them. You see the ingredients there. So I got spicy nacho cheese and one barbecue. I don't know why they have a chili pepper on that one. I wonder if it's spicy as well. I will also test my ketones when I try these. Then I got a sucre and gold brown sugar. I really like the way this one tastes. It's not as oily as the um, Swerve one, so I got a bag of that. I've been talking in some of my later uh, videos about this Toffee Crunch um, Nuts and More peanut butter. I got the salted caramel, and it's pretty good. It tastes really good on ice cream, but um, this one I remember it tasting better than the salted caramel, so I'm going to try that. I know they changed their uh, recipe so it might be uh, not as flavorful as I remember it but we'll see it's two net carbs for two tablespoons 180 calories those are the ingredients then I finally got one keto bar it feels very oily and broken inside it's um, not the warmest day we've had so far this year but it is a little warm outside so I'm thinking that's why it got kind of messed up but this is Chocolate chip cookie dough, I'm going to put that in the fridge before I test it. I got these Revel snacks, I think is how you say it. I don't really like cinnamon, so I don't care for uh, snickerdoodle. But um, this is the only flavor that looked kind of appealing. So um, I wanted to try these. They look really good, and I've seen people taste like the matcha ones and stuff. Uh, which I don't like matcha either, so this was the lesser of all the evils. Two net carbs for two bites. And there's the ingredients there. Then I got these uh, Keto Wise Fat Bombs. They are maltitol free, which I liked. I'm trying to get away from that stuff. Um, two net carbs, it says for two pieces, which is pretty exciting. Those are the ingredients. And I also got these Indulge Milk Chocolate Caramel Squares. I'm hoping these aren't melted. So two net carbs per three pieces. Really excited about that. I think these have maltitol in them. Yep, there's the first ingredient, maltitol. So I got these Nush cakes. I love cakes, so I'm hoping these are good. This one's blueberry, just like with the um, Revel. Uh, this is kind of the best flavor that appealed to me. I wish I had like a birthday cake one. That would be amazing. Supposed to be three net carbs per cake. Those are the ingredients. Then, even though I love Chompies, I always want to try new products. And a lot of people have been talking about this Sola bread. I'm not happy that it has sesame seeds on it. I missed that when I was buying it. But um, I'm going to go ahead and try this one and do a ketone test for it. So it has three net carbs in one slice, 60 calories. And those are the ingredients. Oh, it's also made with vital, vital wheat gluten. I didn't realize that. So that'll be in an upcoming product review video. So I got a bag of Smart Sweets again. Um, it said online that they changed their formula with this one. Oh man, they did. This has a lot of carbs in one bag, so they definitely changed their formula. They're using allulose now, and it looks like they got rid of their chicory root fiber, but I wonder if the um, the amount of carbs is still going to kick me out of ketosis. So I'm going to try that in a product review. I've got a suggestion to try these Smart Sweet Chews. They're supposed to be like Starburst. So 
I'm excited to try these because I love Starburst. One bag is 120 calories. Also a lot of carbs. So this is 15 net carbs per bag. So I will try that eventually. Looks like it also doesn't have chicory root fiber. So I will have that in a product review video. I've had this before and it's really good on like um, cakes or, or whatever you want to put it on top of ice cream, I'm sure. Um, but it's Smucker's uh, topping. It has one net carb for two tablespoons, 30 calories. It has maltitol syrup in it. I haven't tested my ketones for this. I probably should. Maybe I'll do that when I'm closer to the end of the second one. But I got two of those. I have heard from uh, another channel that this is a really good sauce, so I don't like um, supporting this brand, but I wanted to give it a try. So, two tablespoons is 80 calories and one carb. So, we'll see if that's any good. I have a lot of um, wing sauce, so I'm, I'm interested to see how that's different. I got this uh, chocolate, this is chocolate hazel. I think it's supposed to be chocolate and hazelnut. Yeah, it's cacao and hazelnut um, with maltitol, it says. So maltitol is the first ingredient, ingredient. So we'll see how this is. This is the brand that makes um, the jam that I got in my last nutrition order. So um, I'm interested to see how this compares to the pure hazelnut spread that I, I have. Then I finally got my first Chalk Zero product. I thought I had ordered the white chocolate chips, but I guess I got the um, regular chocolate chips. So I got these. They are a little melted. I could feel that some of the chips melted and formed a larger chip. But this is the nutrition. 70 calories, one net carb, 6 grams of fat, so that's really awesome. And then the ingredients are listed there too. Soluble corn fiber. So I will test my ketones when I try this as well. Then I got another low carb tortilla. I have read your guys' comments and I, I totally understand and agree with you. It's hard to get through without having some sort of wrap. So I have this one and two other tortillas that I'm wanting to try um, to try and find a better option than the mission carb balanced tortillas because that did kick me way out of ketosis. So. I'm going to try these in a product review video coming up. Okay, that is all I have for you guys in this video. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you have any suggestions for any products maybe that you've tried um, and would like me to try, test my ketones for, I would love to hear your suggestions. I love trying new products, if that wasn't clear in my video today. But um, I really like trying new products and um, I'm still trying to fix my diet so that I am having foods that I really like but that are also good for me. Um, so I'm trying to find new products to incorporate regularly in my diet. So if you have any suggestions, definitely let me know. If you have any nutrition suggestions, let me know because nutrition has definitely become my favorite uh, go-to keto website now. So that is all I have for you guys in this video. I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.